This is gonna be great. Can't wait for this. All right, here we are in the mystery machine, driving along in some fog at night. Here's a newspaper talking about a museum and its jewels and its jerk off in the window here, checking out this necklace and this naked statue. Ah, he's a ghost thief and he grabs stuff. See, there he is right now, grabbing that necklace. And he defies gravity. This guy right here must have seen him do it. Nah, they went bankrupt. Well, I guess their guard really couldn't stop that gravity-defying ghost thief jerk-off. I don't blame him. I mean, I probably couldn't stop him either. Uh, they're talking about out of gas. The trail ends here. Creepy place for a mystery. Uh, shopping malls. You know, a whole bunch of bullshit. Jekyll Mansion, Dr. Jekyll Potions, Mr. Hyde. I want some cheese. What? Re he he he. Uh, God. Alright, well, I don't really care about all this talking right now. I'm gonna skip all this. They're gonna stand outside. I don't know. These guys, they went inside. More stuff. I'll skip all this. I don't care. Alright, here we go. Uh, in this game, you can select your character. That's pretty cool. We're gonna leave Shaggy and Scooby to stand out there and do nothing. Uh, since I skipped all the story, I guess I gotta tell you about it myself. Basically, that guy in the coat is Dr. Jekyll's son, like Jekyll Jr., I guess you'd call him. He's a scientist too, but the problem is he really sucks. All his inventions have been invented, you know, hundreds of years ago or whatever. He tried to make an electric light. He tried to make a horseless carriage. He tried to bring a hot dog to life, he called it beef. Frankenstein, I don't know, the government used to give him money until they realized that he really sucked, so they pulled the money off him, so now he's broke and he's got no money to waste, but his last failure was a potion he was trying to make, I don't know what he was going for, but he ended up making a potion like his dad did, and he forgets what happened after he drank it, so he thinks that it might have turned him into that ghost that's been stealing necklaces from the museum. Up. Oh. What's this chiming noise? What's going on? Why is the clock chiming? It's 13 minutes past the hour. I was wondering why I was just standing still one spot for so long. Oh shit, what's going on? Ah, uh, fuck. There goes some green guy. Now usually I wouldn't fuck with no green guys, but Daphne probably would. She sleeps with like black guys, and Asian guys, and the Irish. Telepot. What the fuck is a telepot? It looks like a toilet with some big ass Vandegraaff gener- Oh, it's a, it's a teleporter. In the bathroom. Well, I'm gonna use this teleporter. What do you see, Daphne? Ah, uh, yeah, pull the flush handle, whatever, just do it. And I can't move. Oh! Good job, bitch. Hey, isn't that speed buggy? You know that, that, that car that talks like, bah, 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 bah. He, that's what he talks like, speed buggy right there. Oh yeah, this game is broken up into chapters which are like, I guess, two minutes apart. So that's how I'm going to split up these videos because, you know, I don't even think I can handle this much excitement. So I'm going to stop it right here. But I think it's pretty safe to say that that uh, Jekyll Jr. is probably the bad guy in the mask at the end, but you know what? We could see somebody else soon, I don't know.